So we have this problem right over here. A ball is rotating with a velocity of 1 meter per second. Its mass is equal to 2 kilograms and its radius is equal to 5 meters. What will happen to the velocity when the radius becomes 10 meters? And so we understand from this law, and we made a part one video on this law, that the angular momentum is going to be conserved, meaning it will be the same. So the mass is equal to 2 times its velocity, which is 1, times the radius, which is 5. And so the angular momentum here is going to be, and we cannot forget the units, so it's going to be 10 meters per second kilograms. Okay, so now that we've gotten over this, we need to understand what is going to happen to the velocity when this changes. And so we're going to have P is equal to 10, and we're going to conserve that. So 10 is equal to the mass, which is not going to change, the radius, which we say is going to change, and the velocity, which is unknown. So we don't know that. And so since 2 times 10 is equal to 20, and this is our new velocity here is equal to 10, obviously our new velocity is going to equal 10 over 20. It's going to be 1 over 2 meters per second.